All right, so there isn't a fridge in this cabin, but we can start staring, staring. We can start storing non-perishables. Can opener, bean soup. Oh shit, I missed it. There we go. Empty bottle. We'll leave the ramen noodles. We'll leave. Hey, hey, hey! Cooking pot. There you go. How Skype? What? Sorry. It's true bromance. <laughs> yeah, Jason. <gasps> Nails. Okay, so for those of you who haven't seen this yet, I'll just show you. Also, what the fuck? Fertilizer? Scotch tape, I know about. Scotch tape. Scotch tape. We're gonna take that. Gimme. Bag of plastic powder, lighter, radish seeds. What's up with the fertilizer though? It's two pounds. Must be for farming. So look, you got a box of nails. Hey, random cow, welcome to you. And picadillos. Having a pretty damn good day, man, I gotta say. So you take the nails and you right click on them and you open them. Poof, 100 nails. Then you can just repack it. Hundred nails. So then it's just easier to manipulate and maneuver and stuff. And all the stuff. Fertilizer goes in the bag. I think we might keep pushing for tonight. I know it's late, but I want to make it to a, a house with some proper... Uh... Actually, before I go... Hmm. I want to make it to a house with a proper refrigerator so that... All this good food we got doesn't go... So what's that about a new version? How new are we talking about? Well, this is version 19. Um, it's got a whole bunch of shit, dude. Somebody want to throw up that link? That I was throwing up earlier? What time is it where you are? Where I am, it is 12.33 in the afternoon. So what is new? Let me think. There's a new repairing system. It was released over the last two days, I believe. There was an initial little testy phase where people could opt in by reading a certain thread on the forums. And there was now this, which is more of an open testing build. Okay, so we gotta go further south, I believe. Yeah, no, it's too late. We can't do it. I'm not, it's not worth the risk. Thank you, Bummy. Bum 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 bum. Bum 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 bum. Okay, I'll stop. Uh, the new repairing system is fairly fucking epic, so you can use things like wood glue, regular glue, string, twine, rope, duct tape. Uh, what else goes into that? I'm not sure what else goes into that repair. There are other things, though, so it's a totally new repairing system. That's, like, brand spanking new. You can now fill sandbags and gravel bags with sand or gravel, respectively, and make walls. Have I got myself lost? I sure do. Fantastic, Twiggy. You're great at this game. <laughs> Were you making the Darth Vader theme, my jingle? No, what is that? Do 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 do. Do 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 do. What is that from? Dodge approves of this stream. Welcome. Tom, so mad. What are you mad about? Oh yeah, if you haven't played since three months ago, dude, you're in for a shock and a treat. There is so much new shit from three months ago, dude. Like, let alone fucking, like, all this new food, like ham and grapes and corn, stuff like that. Meat patties, you can make burgers, pizza, all kinds of new food tiles. There's potato salad. There's that scotch tape I was talking about. That's for repair. That shouldn't be in the food bag. Uh, Spiffo is new to you, then. Uh, what else is new to you in here? Uh, box of nails would be new to you. You actually pack 100 nails into a box, then you can unpack it. You can pack 24 shotgun shells into a box. Uh, da, 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 da. Sweet.
That tune you said from Scooby-Doo, I think? I'm not sure. Oh, did you see the link that uh, Bummony threw up there? That's that's the entire changelog. That's like all of the things. That's everything you need. Did I accidentally turn on my oven? I just want to drink. It won't let me. This is strange. Alright, drink from the toilet. Oh, weird. The water doesn't work in this building. Strange. Should I take it? No, I shouldn't. I should not. I should refrain. Let's get out of here. You haven't played PZ in one or two years? Dude, you're in for a treat. Demon Prince Sinka. Welcome. Welcome to all you fine people. Thanks for joining me. I haven't said that enough today. I really do appreciate all you guys coming and hanging out. This is the reason I stream. Like, the chat, right there. Thanks for two screens, so now I can play as well. Awesome, dude. I always appreciate that. People come and hang out, and they'll play their own game. Doesn't even have to be the same game I'm playing in. Whatever. Do whatever you're gonna do. Have fun, dude. If you're here for the commentary, enjoy the commentary. If you're here for the video, mute me. You know what I mean? Like, I'm okay with this. I know what happens. It's part of the streaming gaming world, you know? Sometimes you want someone on the second screen just to watch, to keep an eye on, see how they're doing. Sometimes you want some audio commentary and no video, you know? Whatever suits your purposes, I'm here to fill your needs. Oh, my god! What just happened? That's the first time I've seen that. We've got a lighting issue. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Found a tea bag. Yeah, we're gonna restart very quickly here, guys. Just for the purposes of. Are you gonna build a house? We'll get around to that. Those are goals. Do 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 do. I thought I saw someone with a long survival time. I've lasted up to one hundred and ninety-four days on PZ Max. That's interesting. That's the longest I've ever heard of. If it's true, Nicholas. Also, my computer's broken. I'm getting a new one for Christmas, but I got the pre-alpha on Desura. Cool, demon. Well, then you can transfer your pre-alpha key to Steam if you haven't already. Would it be better to have your character move slower and remove the bag from your back if you're taking something out of your bag or even crouch down to take something if you're just leaving it the way it is? I'm not sure what you mean. My character's pretty dandy right now, like in terms of carrying and stuff. Like, we're doing pretty good. Also, that rectified all our issues. Sweet. Boogie. I got 108 days, Nicholas. 107 we got bit, 108 we died. The train tracks. They'll lead us back to civilization. Cynthia Hodgetts running out of the woods. She had traveled days on the highway from West Point, making his way, making her way to the cabin in the woods. She left behind a couple of non-perishables. Now she's making her way back to Maldra. Uh, when logging into Sura's website, go to this page, collection on the keys. Yeah, he's got it. That's the that's the method. Yeah, that was Kimberly Cook. Survived 108. Oh hey, outer shift. Welcome. The patch kept crashing? 
Okay, did you have a previous build installed before you overrode it with this? Like, did you have, say, build 18 installed or 17, a number down here, and then you just auto-updated and it, like, automatically went up to this new version? When you're moving fighting zombies, you have a status bar above your head. What do you mean? I don't. Oh, when you're moving things out of your bag. Yeah, they had plans to change all that, random cow. This is just for the time being, right? There's going to be a crouching system and all that kind of stuff. But you can't actually swing your bat when you're... Ooh. Like, I can't swing... Oh, I can. They changed it. You didn't used to be able to swing when you're... Uh... When you were picking up things. Will this game ever have multiplayer? Welcome, Zion Z. It will indeed. That is a plan. It is part of the, uh, you know, the goal. But they want to make a not only solid, but a fucking fantastic single-player survival game experience first. And that includes NPCs, like wide varieties of NPCs, sadistic AI director, all this kind of shit, right? So it's going to happen. It's part of the plan. It's just that multiplayer at the moment is m low priority. Steam updated it. Okay, cool, Outer Shaft. So for anyone who's having issues with uh, getting the new version to work, this is what I always do personally. I can't say that it'll work for everyone all the time, but it works for me like 99% of the time when I'm having issues. Go to your C colon. Program files x86 Steam. Steam apps come in and find your Project Zomboid directory. Delete the entire contents and the main folder. Once you've completed this task, Please proceed to your C colon users. Your particular username. Oh, we got a tweet or something. I'll check in a minute. Then you will find a zomboid folder underneath your username. You will then delete that directory as well so that there's nothing remaining of your previous Project Zomboid install. Yeah, PZ is a very steep learning curve. Hey, welcome, Dapper Dogman. Welcome back, dude. It's good to see you again. Welcome to all you fine people. Oh, Spazman gave us a retweet. Dylan Cotter, watch. Return to PZ, new version, release 19. On Twitch TV with Sir Twiggy. Thank you very much, Dylan Cotter, and the follow. It's greatly appreciated. And Random Cow and Anthony Roberts, Mr. Spazman. Also, your voice would fit for a radio station. Thank you very much, Mr. Zion Z. Hopefully, one day we'll have a career in entertainment and or streaming video content. That's the goal. That's what I want to do, is I want to be a content provider or some kind of diet. Or some kind of commentator. I really, I like the idea. And thank you, I really appreciate it. What's that? What's that name? How would I see that? Gump? Gumparama. Gumparampa. Welcome to the street. Anyone getting video stutter? No, I don't think I'm uh, dropping any frames. So I need to uninstall the game and install it again? You're deleting all the things, Outer. All of the remaining Zomboid artifacts, so you make sure that nothing overwrites or does anything like that. So you gotta delete Project Zomboid from your Steam directory, and you have to delete all the configuration things from your users folder. It's not just uninstalling and reinstalling. There's a lot of zombies in there. Wish they'd come out after me. Come on! I followed thanks to Bandit Pants. Well, thank you very much to Mr. Bandit Pants. I'm a fan of that channel. Hey, Twiggy, please play Oregon Trail. It's the best game ever. I think I can be convinced to try it out. It's not gonna be today. But someday. Oh, fuck, I couldn't smack them when they were down because they were in a tight little corner. Come on, then. So there's one in here as well, with the consensus. You're dead, Zambi. 
All right, so we got ourselves a dirty little house. I say dirty because I just...